Celi tu mio sef decus atque nostre, certo spes vite columen que mundi. Hello, men and brothers of St. Paul the Apostle Parish. This is Deacon Michael Goodwin. And I think I, if you remember a few weeks back, I had presented a possibility of going on a consecration to St. Joseph journey over the next 33 days. And today is the day it would start and it would end on May 1st. So that goes from March 30th to May 1st. Well, in between my initial invitation and today, there was the whole spread of the pandemic and the encouragement to stay in our homes. So I just wanted to re, uh, present this invitation and see if any of you are interested in joining me on this journey. The journey is going to take a little bit of a different approach. Um, each day, I attempt to share with you the daily reflection from this book, Consecration to St. Joseph, followed by praying the prayer together um, of consecration, the prayer of the litany of St. Joseph. And then, uh, as we make our way through this journey, uh, we can have a more uh, community-based and interactive time together. If you would like to be a part of this journey, I will be sending this invitation out by email uh, through our parish realm email system i'll also be posting it up on our facebook page our parish facebook page but i also intend to create a facebook group for the men of men of saint paul the apostle and so if you're really interested in being a part of this journey you can be join that facebook group you can also reply to the email i send and let me know if you'd like to receive a daily email with this um video that I'll be creating each day so we can pray this prayer together. And I pray that this will be a truly enriching time for you. St. Joseph is a great model of our faith. Uh, he was the foster father of Jesus, and he teaches us as men how in our homes to invite Jesus into our lives beyond just going to church, letting Jesus flood and have his place in our homes, in our lives of prayer in the home, and being models and witnesses to the rest of our family of being men of prayer men of faith, men of virtue, all these things are the things we discover in the person of St. Joseph. So this is what we'll be actually experiencing and learning over these next few weeks as we take this consecration journey together over 33 days. Mm -hmm.